For the second time in his session, Uzaifa Wampa did not show face. As the seven appeared via video conferencing, their lawyer Jeffrey Tudiam Sima has also raised concerns of the missing suspect in different prison cells. It is therefore our prior Your Honor, that the same state which presented him on that day was the same state which has the obligation or took on the obligation to take him to prison. Inform this honorable court of his whereabouts. The suspect's lawyer, Jeffrey Triam Sima, welcomes court's ruling. Of course, the ruling is a 50 50. One, because the constitutional, it's their constitutional right to access their lawyer or their doctors. The accused on his last appearance raised the issue of insecurity surrounding his incarceration. To be sincere, the last communication we got, that was then when he had been brought out of this court, was that he had not yet reached Chitalia. And uh, you know we cannot communicate to Chitalia prison. At the same time we cannot go there because they cannot allow us. Court, however, declined the plea in writing to prison authorities on access to clients. Similar request to allow the suspect's victims of torture access their personal doctors was quashed. Last month, Nakawa Chief Magistrate Douglas Singiza remanded the group to Chitalia Government Prison over purported torture by security agencies. The group is also suspected of involvement into the murder of Brenda Nantongo, a daughter to General Katumba, and his driver, Sergeant Haruna Kayondo, on 1st of June, 2021. Flavia Ninkuze, CTV, PM Edition.